So this last one is really useful. It's uh, measuring slope aspect. So which way the slope faces that you're on. And it's really useful in situations where it, you've got low visibility and you want to know which side of the hill you've come off, for example. Make sure you're, you're on the right side. Or if you are going up a hill and we're in quite a sweeping coombe basin here and we want to know which way we want to go to get to the, the, the top, whether we need to head off that way or head off that way. So to get the slope aspects really easy, if you imagine you put a stone here and roll the stone downhill, where would that stone stop? So you're taking the fall line of the slope and then you get your compass and use the direction of travel arrow as we've done before and you line that up with where the boulder, the rock would stop. And then you rotate the compass housing so that the red needle in the compass housing lines up with a red magnetic needle and then that gives you the slope aspect. You can then, as we've done before, line up the lines within the compass housing onto the grid lines on the map, the blue lines, so that the edge of the compass will then give you the aspect of the slope. So you know uh, we're on this curved line here somewhere, so just by lining up the arrows and moving it up and down, you can tell that wherever the contour lines are crossed at 90 degrees, so we know not, we know we're not there because the edge of the compass doesn't go directly downhill, we know we are on this part of the slope there. So then we can use that information to take a bearing or do any other things that we've discussed previously. Hope this has been useful. It's like everything though, you've got to get out and practice it and ideally practice it when the visibility is good and when you don't need it so that you are well versed and used to taking bearings when you do need it, when everything goes wrong. So get out there and practice. If you've liked this video, feel free to drop me a comment below. Let me know any comments or suggestions or any other tips you may have yourself on, on how to use a map and compass. And um, subscribe for updates if you feel like it. That'd be great. It'd be great to have you along on this journey of mine. And um, hope to see you in the hill soon sometime. Stay safe out there and I'll see you in the next video. I can now put everything away and stop looking like a complete leap noob. And get up there onto the mountain.